political act of the story is simply putting both sides of a very intense conflict front and center and allowing them to speak their piece. In a culture that's deeply polarized, if you can watch a story about people who couldn't be more different from each other, it may make you ask, what is it gonna take in the current circumstances to see if there's any common ground? Before Oslo was a film, it was a play, but the origin story is almost like out of a film itself. My daughter's best friend in second grade was the daughter of Mona Yule and Terry Rod Larson. We became friends, and I introduced Taya to JT. And he started to tell me the story of the secret back channel that they had put together with a handful of Israelis and members of the Palestine Liberation Organization. And I thought, sweet Lord, that's my next play. What's really fascinating about this is these two characters are driven not only by the idea of creating peace, but also doing it underhand and not through the official channels. Larson is probably a bit more reckless in some way, sort of instinctive. You're a junior minister and Terry's just a sociologist. Then that must be enough. And Mona is more... Methodical. What would you say? Methodical, exactly. Yeah. They're a great team. When I read the script, I told myself, oh my God, I am so lucky because it's so important. We felt like we were doing something momentous when in fact these real life characters were risking their lives. If the world finds out what you are all doing, there will be riots, blood will be spilt. What fascinated me about these men is that they were changed by how they saw the enemy. By seeing the enemy as a human being, you are changed. Oslo is a reminder that we are all human beings and we all need to make this world a better place. I can do business with this man. I think this is going to work. Also, it has that question of what is it you do if you get in the room with your greatest enemy, and it tries to be hopeful. There's something beautiful about seeing a story where people have the courage to move beyond their personal hatreds and fears and see their enemy as a person, to be changed by that, and in some cases, to be friends for the rest of your life. You're going to change the world.